Welcome to this training video on making your first charts. You can download the exercise workbook to follow along in your own copy of Tableau. Tableau allows you to analyze and visualize your data with no programming knowledge. All you have to do is double click or drag and drop the fields you want to analyze. This video will show you how to create charts by double clicking on existing fields. What we call fields are the dimensions and measures on the left-hand data panel visible after you have connected to your data set. If you're not sure what these terms refer to, please watch our previous video on connecting to Excel and text files. Here, our data set contains data about countries' CO2 emissions over time. There are various elements we can analyze. If I'm interested in visualizing these countries on a map, I can simply double click on the field country name. I obtain a map where every single country in my data set is shown. This isn't giving us much insight yet. What would be helpful would be to visualize how much CO2 each of these countries have been emitting. Let's double click on the field CO2 in kilotons. The sum of CO2 emissions is automatically added to the visualization, coding the size of the bubbles. Now I can see that if I sum up the 60 years of CO2 emissions contained in my data set, the US and China are the two countries that emitted the most CO2. Let's create another chart. We may also want to analyze the evolution of CO2 emissions over time. To do so, I double click on the dimension year, which creates a horizontal axis. Then I double click on the measure CO2 in kilotons, and I obtain a line chart showing me world CO2 emissions over the past 60 years. I can easily see that the total CO2 emissions have multiplied by five since 1960. As our data set also contains information by region, let's see what happens when we double click on the dimension region. We get one colored line for each of the regions and we can see that in recent years, the East Asia and Pacific region has consistently been the biggest producer of CO2 emissions after overtaking North America and Europe and Central Asia region in the late 1990s. Let's wrap it up with a reminder that double clicking on fields is the easiest way to create charts in Tableau. A deeper understanding of the logic behind charts will help you create visualizations that are more elaborate. Thank you for watching this Creating Charts video. We invite you to continue with the Show Me Toolbar video.